Blast Marahi. My name is Dan. I'm five years old. And today I'm in Pakistan Museum of Natural History. It's not bad. And today I you know, just uh, heard about many very important topics. But I'm going to show you one very important to topic. It is Blochi Thayam. What Blochi Thayam means? Blochi means Blochistan. Thayam means beast. It is the beast of Blochistan. It was, uh, it lived approximately lived about 30 million years ago and became extinct in 11 million years ago. Ha <laughs> ha! That <laughs> is very short as time and it is only 5 meters and it was 20 tons. Oh. And you can see it. It's over here. Yeah, it's very big. Yeah, it was very big. Okay. Already, its meters was tall, small, but its uh, tons were very big. Hmm. So, now, I can tell you that who discovered Blochi first? It was Sir Clive Foster Cooper in 1911. He, uh, he found extraordinary bones of Blochi He was an English, French, uh, he was an English paleontologist. After that, there was a very, very, very long gap. It was in 1990. 90 years uh, after, uh, you know, the research, it, uh, after that, there was nobody who researched. After that, in 1990, it, uh, the second research happened. It was Jean Loup Wolkan. Uh, Wolkan was a French paleontologist, and you know, he also you know uh, done very good researches, and he found the first you know first finger of Blochi theory, and you know many other things. And he was not alone. Okay. He, there was a stakeholder. Okay. Pakistan Museum of Natural History. Okay. There I am. This was the stakeholder. Okay. So, so okay. You mean that many paleontologists were from right. the Pakistan Museum of Natural History. They were also working right. in that mission. Okay. Right. Okay, good. Okay. So now uh, be uh, be very be very serious. Okay. All right, sir. Now, now, okay. Let's go to a very good thing that why the project can become extinct. Oh, why did Blogitherium become extinct? All right. This land mammal, why did it become extinct? Because the, uh, the formation of the uh, Asian Africa was destroyed. Oh. And Blogitherium became extinct. Uh, sea was, prehistoric sea was disappeared. It was 30s. 30s. Okay. And it used to be two ton grass, but we are from grass, okay? Blogitherium is a desert. So Blogitherium is a desert. Yeah, so Blochitan is a desert, you are talking that from where it was grazing so much grass, taking so much grass, two tons grass per day, huh? Uh, okay. There was a holocaust in Epoch and it was lush green like the Amazon is lush green. Hmm, you mean the Blochitan was lush green that time? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And Oligocene Epoch was the Epoch. There, there's a Molycene Epoch, these type of you know, Epochs are there. And, you know, that is of okay, now. Now, Blochitherium was not a dinosaur. You consider it true. And it is now not, it's a mammal. It's okay. not a dinosaur. So, you belong to which kingdom, which phyla, yeah, which? Kingdom is Kingdom Animalia, Phylum Chordata, Class Mammalia. And uh, genus? Uh, yeah, genus Parasy. Parasiratabia. Okay. That is extinct genus, Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. Blochitherium is extinct, okay? Okay, yeah. Probably lived very long time ago. Okay. And what the fossils? I'm going to um, uh, share. There was a Gondwana land which included subcontinent, Australia, um, so, uh, South America, and, you know, more of them. Uh, Europe, Europe, and, you know, or more of them. Except North America. Okay. was not over uh, there. Not in uh, over there. land. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So now, here's a, a question that you, when a fossil, you know, what is found, the form and fossils and what are fossils? Fossils are the genus, you know, fossils are the uh, extinct of uh, animals, what that were millions of years ago alive. Okay. When an animal dies, it gets quickly buried. And after that, it's pressed, uh, it's flushy decomposed by bacteria in the top soil. And okay. also, I mean that, you know, mud and clay and sand and are pressed. And also, uh, this thing happened during earthquakes and rain, which washes away the sand and, you know, it shows uh, the fossils. But so not every uh, one rises to the, uh, you know, to the, uh, to the uh, ground. 
Okay. Some are Europe, some are Europe. Are very deep and paleontologists have to dig for a dig for a long time. Okay. So this was all. These were my last words to you. Okay. okay uh, of of my report. And now, if you want to see my more videos, check this down dot com. You'll see a lot of interesting videos and and everybody should come over here and learn about very important things. So I'll be waiting for your feedback. Thanks wonderful so wonderful thank you so much you have told us uh, everything about the fossils how are they formed three steps and paleontology lots of stuff about that we we'll love you a lot thank you very much and what will be the next topic and i mean um it will be rocks and soil okay okay thank you allah hafiz love you